Have you ever just been sat there in your room and thought to yourself, you know what? I'm going to play a video game. And among your vast library of games, you find one that looks sort of, sort of appealing. So you're like, hell yeah, I'm going to play some freaking video games right now. And then you load up the game that you find in your library. And then you play like 20 minutes of it. And then you shut it down because you're bored. And then you think to yourself, how the hell did I play like six hours of video games every day as a kid and in a vain attempt to rekindle this passion you load up an old game from your childhood but you find that it just doesn't hit the same have you ever felt this way because i have now to those who feel the same way or ex or are experiencing the same thing I'm, I'm sure a lot of you kind of are thinking like Oh, how can I possibly be bored? How can I not spend more than 20 minutes playing a game when they're just so good? They're so much better than they used to be. There's so much to them. And I, I can't even bring myself to, you know, play the first mission or play more than one or two games online. Now, if you're an avid Twitter user, I'm sure Twitter's convinced you that's probably down to depression, ADHD, anxiety, or something else like that. But we all know that's not true because those things don't exist. <laughs> nah, I'm just kidding. Of course they do. But you know, I'm not a doctor, so I, I, I don't know. I, I mean, it could very well be one of those reasons. It could be due to that. It's, it's very, very possible. But then I had a, um, I had another sort, sort of thought. Most of us started playing video games when we were quite young, and so we've, they've been in our lives for so long. So I think, in a way, because it's been, because we, it's been around us for so long that we've kind of convinced ourselves that we we should like it or that we have to like them because you know as we get older or as we age our interests change and i think uh, because when, when people can't play games for more than a certain amount of time or they, they can you know they just, they just can't concentrate on a game i i think it, it makes people frustrated uh, you know it makes me frustrated that that i can't play games for hours on end or have as much fun as i used to and i think we try to we 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 want to like them you know, you know, have you ever been in a position where you, you want to be into something, you, you want to like it, but no matter how much you watch it, listen to it, or whatever, you just can't? And I think that's sort of what's happened with video games for a lot of people. But then I thought, maybe it's the games we're playing or how we're playing them. You know, for example, I've, I've had a subscription to World of Warcraft since January 2005, which means I've had a subscription to World of Warcraft for over half of my life and you know when I go back to play it it's it's no wonder that it's boring because I have just played it for so goddamn long yeah 15 years I've played that game for of course it's gonna get old and stale and I think that's probably a big problem is that a lot of us we play the same same sort of games I, I always find myself gravitating to more towards first-person shooters for some reason, even though I find them just boring as shit. But for some reason, I found this sort of CSGO clone, this Turkish copy and paste of CSGO. And I'm, I'm playing it right now in the, in the gameplay, and it's for some reason, I, I'm having way much more fun with that than normal CSGO or something like Call of Duty for, for some unknown reason. But the last time where I actually spent like an entire day playing a game, it, it was No Man's Sky. And that was just when I first got it. When I first realized that they did all the um, they they fixed it. They did all the things they promised. I was just like, oh, just I was just like, oh. but I haven't played it properly since. And that was like last March. Uh, I, I went to play it, I think a few weeks ago, and it, and it's just like. But there's so many games I want to play or want to get into, like PUBG, for example. You know, it, it, I've played a few games recently, and it's quite fun. But it's just so just oh, I, I just don't I just don't have any patience anymore. It's I, it's just patience. You know, I, I just I, I, the other day I played I, play, I was playing PUBG, right? You know, being all tactical, being all sneaky, sneaky, sneaky. Had all my guns and stuff, and go poof, dead. And I was like, it was like 10, 20 minutes, and it's just like. And, now, now I gotta do it all again, you know, and I gotta, you know, gotta wait to leave the game. Gotta wait a minute for the game to start. 
Then I gotta fly the plane. Then I gotta fall out the plane. Then I gotta land. And then I can start over again. I think the last time I was properly into a game where I was playing it quite a lot was Overwatch. And I was playing, I got, I got really got into competitive and I just, I was sweating it so hard, even though I was gold. But now, uh, you know, I, just, I don't, don't really care. Uh, that's the problem. Like, if it, it's, it, that's the thing, that's the, that's the problem. If I can find a game that, you know, I, I care about the rank, I'm genuinely like, you know, passionate about, I will play it. I will just like sweat, I'll get all sweaty. I won't shower for days. I'll just, you know, eat shit food all day get my gamer fuel going and just play that game but i just i i i, I launch up overwatch join a competitive game and i'm just like eh, i don't really give a shit now you know i used to be like oh my god gonna, we're gonna lose we're gonna lose I'm gonna do it. <laughs> now it's just like oh, oh great we lost fucking dumbass winston name and i was kind of hyped for cyberpunk for a while actually um but we all know where that ended up but yeah I th like i said earlier i think a lot of us are kind of burnt out from video games and i think there's really two things to do really one is find a new hobby or two play something just different like something you really wouldn't do just something completely random just an obscure you know something just like you just wouldn't play like for example i got myself the original xbox a little while ago and i got myself blinks and nhl big hits 2002 and for some reason that game just slaps i don't know what it is it's so basic and just you know old but for some reason i i, I find it way more fun than a game like cyberpunk for whatever reason, but I think that's just the problem, you know, a lot of us, um, everyone really to an extent, you know, w whether it's movies, music or whatever, we all have an idea of what we like or our style. And I feel like a lot of people are very, very stubborn or are, are afraid to kind of deviate from what they're used to. And so, you know, when they're used to the same thing over and over and over and over and over, we get bored and burnt out, like a lot of us are. And I and I think, and I, I in my experience, I found that just big radical changes or just something com just completely random, something that, you know, just, you just, just wouldn't do normally. It, it just, it's just so much more fun because it's like an, a completely different world. You know, it, with the same sort of video games, with first person shooters and, kind of games like that you know we've kind of explored a, a lot of it you know we're, we're very used to it we're used to the mechanics we're used to everything about them really and i'll give you an example uh from my own experience now it's not with video games it's with films and i, I know that's sort of different but i think the message kind of still it still applies in this situation now me normally i watch comedies just you know things like pineapple express uh, anything was with uh, Seth Rogen in it, for example. Um, so one day, I was on my Amazon Prime, you know, Amazon Video, and I just decided to spice it up a bit. I saw Parasite advertised at the top, and I watched that. Now I know it's a comedy, but you know, it's, it's a bit different. It's kind of, it's not that same sort of positive vibes as something like Pineapple, Ex Pineapple Express, for example. So I watched that, and it had been years since I watched a film and was generally gravitated by it, generally was watching it, not being distracted by my phone, computer, or anything else. And because it was just such a different kind of thing to what I'm normally used to. And I think the same message applies when it comes to other things like video games. You know, you, you, you watch the same thing, you play the same thing over and over and over, and then you, you're you asking yourself, oh, wh why am I bored? Because you because we've done the same thing over and over and over, just in a different skin, uh, you know, with a slightly different, you know, gun. You know, you know what I'm trying to say? So if you just kind of mix it up, I don't know, if you're playing Call of Duty Warzone all the time or and you're bored of it, you know, try something maybe like a bit slower pace, like Animal Crossing, for example. Or if you're playing, I don't know, Pokemon a lot, try something and you're getting bored of that, I don't know, play, um, I don't know, something that isn't Pokemon. So to sum up, 
yeah, it's a shame that we can't enjoy video games the same way we used to, but, you know, there's nothing wrong with just not playing games anymore. For me, the one thing that I can get lost in doing, just spend hours on, is making music now. Um, and it's, it's there's nothing wrong with finding something else to pass the time, finding a different hobby. Now, it doesn't need to be creative. It doesn't need to be, you know, constructive or whatever. It, it can just, anything that you can, anything that's different, anything you can find that's just fun. I'm not gonna lie, I'm not really, I'm not entirely sure where I was kind of going with this video because I, I, I didn't write a script or anything like that. I, I wrote like two points, I think. But anyway, the point is, try something different. Whether it be a different genre of video games or whether or not it be something completely different. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, I'm interested to see what you guys think, you know, kind of your experiences and things like that. If you leave them in the comments, and I'm going to be sticking to the kind of leafy-esque format uh, for the time being while I'm still, you know, packing and moving over to my new place. And before you go, don't, 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 don't you dare think about leaving this video without leaving a fat flipping like. And for whatever reason, you've got this far and you're not subscribed, hit that subscribe button, please.